Yeah. It's rewind time. Will Smith is a household name. Sure, he may be known for his movies. After all, they've exceeded $8 billion in revenue worldwide. Or maybe his rap moniker, The Fresh Prince. And who could forget his YouTube channel with 9 million subscribers? But he's also known as a lover of lavish real estate and has owned many homes over the course of his career, each a worthy successor to his famous 90s sitcom home of Bel Air. So, let's take a look at a few of the incredible homes, houses, and mansions of Philly's own The Fresh Prince. Willard Carroll Smith Jr. was born and raised in, you guessed it, West Philadelphia. His mom, Caroline, was a school board administrator, and his dad, Willard Carroll Smith Sr., was a refrigeration engineer. He and his three siblings were brought up Baptist, but it wasn't long before young Will started to have bigger dreams than just a simple life in Philadelphia. He teamed up with DJ Jazzy Jeff, also known as Jeffrey Towns, and Reddy Rock C, real name Clarence Holmes, and he started rapping under the moniker of The Fresh Prince. During this time, their group was known for their fun, comical, and radio-friendly lyrics. And in 1988, they won the first Grammy awarded in the rap category. Things were looking up for Will. Now, Will was making good money during this time, only he didn't quite know how to manage it. In 1988 and 1989, he underpaid his income taxes. And if there's one group of folks you don't want to take off, it's the IRS. They assessed Will's tax debt to be $2.8 million, and they seized many of Will's assets and much of his income. By 1990, Will was nearly bankrupt. He was in need of a miracle, and fast. As luck would have it, that same year NBC was looking for a new sitcom to add to their weekly lineup, and they were quite impressed with the young Will Smith. After meeting with him, they decided to build an entire show around him and his character, The Fresh Prince. Will got his miracle and signed the contract. Just like that, his legendary career took off. From there, Will set a personal goal of becoming the biggest movie star in the world. And it's rumored that he even studied the box office hits of his time looking for common characteristics. He was determined to crack the code and be bigger than anyone had ever been before. And he succeeded. After the end of The Fresh Prince, Will started his movie career and headlined numerous blockbuster films. Massive blockbuster films. In fact, he is the only actor to have eight consecutive films gross over $100 million in the domestic box office. If you add up the revenue of all his movies worldwide, Will's films have racked in a colossal $8.69 billion. That's $352.1 million per film. We'd say he certainly made his goal of becoming one of the world's biggest stars. All of these successes have paid off in a very real way for the Fresh Prince. He currently is worth $350 million. And when you have that kind of money, you can afford to indulge in some of the finer things in life. In Will's case, that happens to be real estate. Mr. Smith has owned some of the most beautiful and elegant mansions ever built, and they've been located all over. Don't believe us. Well, take a look at this first home we got for you, located in none other than the island paradise, Hawaii, right at the famous Secret Beach. In 2015, Smith purchased a stunning $10 million beachfront property on the north shore of Kauai. It has two gated entrances, contains a three-bedroom, three-and-a-half bathroom layout with oversized glass doors and windows, two stunning fireplaces, and even vaulted ceilings. And don't forget, it's right along the water, so when you look out across the beach, you will have the most incredible maritime views available. It also comes complete with a two-bed, two-bath guest house. You know, for when you want to have some friends stay over. The Smiths ended up selling the home for $12 million. And if you can't wrap your head around why, we should tell you first that Will never seems to keep his homes for very long. In fact, previously, he had purchased a seven-acre property also located on Secret Beach, I guess he just really likes the area, for $13.5 million. This 2,200-square-foot home contains three bedrooms, a pool complete with pool house, and a gym. But Will has never forgotten his roots. And even though he certainly has indulged on these Hawaiian properties, we'd like to now turn your attention eastward to none other than Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. A city with more history in one square block than the entirety of most states. 
In 1988, Will purchased a mansion in Bryn Mawr, Pennsylvania for a total of $937,000. This 8,000 square foot property has stunning architecture, while simultaneously being a great place to raise a family. Hop a plane from the Philly airport over to sunny Los Angeles and you'll find another one of the Smith's incredible residences. A five bedroom, six bathroom estate located right in the exclusive Hidden Hills neighborhood. Will snagged it for $3.4 million. And since 2017, this has been the home for Will's son, Jaden Smith. Seems some people just get to live like royalty, huh? Well, wait, uh, we guess he is the son of a prince. The Fresh Prince, that is. Hmm. But this ain't the only home that Will has in Los Angeles. And if you swing over to Woodland Hills, you'll find yet another home purchased by Mr. Smith in 2011. Compared to the other estates, this one's priced a bit more reasonably, only $910,000. Rumor has it that Will bought this home for other family members, or possibly for his staff. Now, the Fresh Prince is always on the move, and up next, we have arguably his most unique and awesome home. It's Will's $2.5 million custom RV. And now that we think about it, this actually may be the perfect residence for a guy that is always hustling, always working, and always pumping out mega hits at the box office. Will has dubbed this super van The Heat and lived in it all throughout the filming of Men in Black 3, Ali, and The Pursuit of Happiness. Inside, you'll find $30,000 worth of leather, bespoke wooden cabinetry, 14 TVs, a 30-person movie lounge, and even a dressing room. And it all sits on 22 glorious wheels ready to roll at a moment's notice. However, all of these places seem to fall short when compared to his main residence, known as the Calabasas Estate, located in the LA County of Calabasas. This incredible 150-acre property cost Will $42 million. Believe it or not, with that much property, the Smiths have their own zip code. Now, that's how you know that you're one of the biggest movie stars in the whole world. You have your own zip code. They bought this ranch back in 2003, and it took both Will and his wife Jada seven years to fully complete their luxury home. There's basketball courts, tennis courts, volleyball courts, and even a sunken trampoline. According to Will, his favorite spot to hang is a private gazebo located at the heart of the estate's lake. But we haven't even come close to the end of the unique and luxurious amenities that the Calabasas Estate has to offer. This chateau harbors its own meditation room with a luxurious thick pile carpet. Will is also an avid book collector, and throughout his incredible mansion, you'll find dark wooden cabinets and shelves to house their massive book collection. Continue walking and you'll see some of the most stunning architecture and furnishings a private residence can offer. There are exposed beams, canopy beds, massive wooden doors, and even a chandelier. It really was a labor of love, and Will and Jada put a lot of time into it. In fact, Will was quoted in Architectural Digest as saying, everything needed to be done by hand. We wanted to feel the love and labor that went into every piece of this place. We'd say, you succeeded, Mr. Smith. You succeeded. Stroll on down to the kitchen and you'll find an open layout, complete with a pizza oven. That's a $50,000 appliance. Keep on walking and you'll find the Smith's very own podcast set for their series called Red Table Talk. This show is streamed on Facebook Watch and members of the Smith family will discuss a plethora of topics ranging from mental health to current events. The final jaw-dropping addition to this Hollywood house how about a state-of-the-art recording studio? Believe it or not, this was the very place that Will's daughter, Willow, recorded her 2010 hit, Whip My Hair, which made her an impressive $4 million in revenue. Seems like father, like daughter, huh? But even with these impressive additions to an already impressive home, Will tries to play it cool and keep it real. He is known for spending time with his family in their many exquisite estates, goofing around with his kids, and he will even take photos of him and his family working out and then post them to Instagram. We gotta say, he seems like a really solid dude. One that definitely deserves all the success and houses that have come his way. Will Smith is one of the most famous and top paid leading men not only of today, but of all time. His movies continue to thrill us, make us laugh, and even shed a tear once in a while. He's a stand-up guy with a stand-up family. 
and he definitely has lived his celebrity life to the fullest and wastes no time in purchasing some of the most beautiful homes we've ever seen. But if you think he's slowing down, think again. He's slated to star in an upcoming biopic about the father of tennis superstar Serena Williams in the 2021 release, King Richard. We know we'll be checking it out. We'll see you next time, right here on The Richest.